This is my Lego Super Shredder. Give you a 360 view. And I'll show you the super cool cutting chamber. Look at that. Pretty nasty. Pretty mean. And these are the same blades that Scourge 120 used for his shredder. Uh, I got these off of eBay. There's a guy that sells these, a bunch of these. And they uh, these have a nice point to them. They're pretty strong and they're good for shredding. So, it's powered by one motor, which is, or the motor drives um, a small eight-tooth gear, and that drives the um, the larger twelve-tooth gears that are attached to each of the two shafts, and that way it gives it more torque and more power. So now I will show you it shredding some stuff, which you probably already guessed is going to be tin foil and or aluminum foil. You're right. Lights pretty bright. There. It's pretty good. Alright, first I will demo it shredding this long strip of aluminum foil. Alright. Here it goes. Oh, hold on. There. Here it goes. Give you a view of the aftermath. This is what happened to it. It's all sort of crumbled up, and you can see there's a bunch of holes in it. Down here too. It doesn't like cleanly cut it, but sometimes it does. It works better with cutting it with paper. But you can see it did rip it and do some considerable damage to it. All right, now I will show you it shredding uh, two long pieces of paper like this. Two. Not at the same time, but I'll show you one and then the other. Alright, here it goes. See, sometimes there is a problem with the shredder. Sometimes the paper gets caught in between the blades and it doesn't shred it. So I'll have to reverse it and try it again. Alright, here it goes. aftermath again and you can see again it's ripped crumbled up and has some holes in it so that one got jammed so uh, it's a good thing I have the other piece to shred too Here goes the second piece. Got caught again in between the blades. Got caught again. Oh. 
Looks like it did some more damage to this one. Yeah, this one did some more damage too. I'll show you. This is what happened. It was down to here, and a good uh, a good quarter of it is completely ripped out. And here's the other pieces that fell off. And that's all there is on the shredder. So yeah, this is a very powerful shredder. Oh wait, hold on a second. There's a fly on my window. I smashed it. Alright, so I will show you of the three objects I had to shred today how they turned out. You can see the paper is nice and ripped up all the way down. Other one not as bad. And the foil is crumbled and ripped. So that is or that was my Lego Super Shredder. Um, in case you're wondering, under here I have some uh, cleaning combs. You can see they're those, um, I think they're 5x3 L-shaped pieces. So I use those as the um, cleaning combs. So it cleans in between the teeth when it's shredding. Oh, piece of paper fell out. Alright, so that is basically my Lego Super Shredder.